What's going on team? So we're going to talk about your about section this time, but before you start this video, make sure you watch this one. If you don't watch that video, this one's not going to make a whole lot of sense because we're actually going to copy and paste the headline that you created from the previous video into ChatGPT and it's going to populate your about section. Super easy. Let's go. Okay, this is gonna be so much easier than you probably think. The key thing here is that once you do all of this, just talk to a mentor, and I'm gonna talk about that in another video within the same series, uh, the importance of finding a mentor after all of this stuff is created. Uh, whether that be American Corporate Partners, whether it be Fourblock or Veterati, you need somebody uh, that's going to look at your profile that has the experience in the corporate world to say, hey, uh, this looks good, or maybe, maybe make a tweak here or there. So you might be asking yourself, where are you even supposed to start with your about section? So the cool thing about this is that you already did the work whenever we created your headline in the last video. That's when it takes a ton of self-reflection. What are, what are you trying to get after? What's your brand, et cetera, so and so forth. And that's what you use those ideas to populate this. So once you already have this, just take it, copy it, go to chat GPT. And then like the last video, I'm also going to have the prompt in the description of this video. So all you have to do is copy and paste it. So here's what we're going to say. Can you write a, actually let's say it like this. Can you write my LinkedIn bio based off of my headline? Let chat GPT do its magic. Okay, so this is what it populated based off of the first uh, prompt that I did. So the more you use ChatGPT, the more you're going to learn about uh, a term called prompt engineering. And basically what you do is it's consistently refining your message. So I wouldn't personally take this and copy that straight into my bio. It kind of reads wonky. I don't like that it's in third person. So I think what I would say here is please rephrase with brevity in mind do not list me as third person so i'm not even a huge fan of this when i said brevity i just wanted it shortened a little bit but i didn't want it shortened that much so i want to say please rephrase and really capitalize on my skill sets I want a recruiter to be able to see my skills and send me a job interview request. So let's see what this produces. So I'm, I'm good with this one. So this one is a lot better. So just by a few different prompts, you can change how the AI answers your question. And that's really one of the greatest things about chat GPT. So make sure that it says what you want. When someone's looking at your profile, just like the other videos, they're going to see your headline. They're going to see your profile picture. They're going to see your LinkedIn banner. And hopefully they're intrigued by that point. And they're going to come down and they're going to read your bio. And that bio is going to reflect that whole person. When they're done with your bio, they might even come down and check out your experience right here. So with that said, that is exactly what the next video is going to be. Uh, I'm going to go with you step by step and we're going to talk about your experience, what you should say, the keywords with it, getting recommendations for your keywords, you name it. So that's it for this video. Hopefully this helps you. Uh, as always, please don't forget to like and subscribe. But with that said, we'll see you in the next video whenever we talk about your experience.